Hi everyone, I'm Annalisa and welcome to another episode of Into the Weeds. So in some weeks we'll be talking about plant problems and what you can do about them and in this week we'll be talking about mealybugs. Mealybugs are white, soft-bodied, cottony looking insects with a protective waxy coating. They unfortunately come equipped with sucking mouth parts and exist under the insect order Hemipetera or true bugs. Mealybugs are similar to scale and aphids in the way that they stick to the stem and the leaves of your plant and from there suck the essential nutrients that your plant needs. And even though it will take a while, the plant will eventually die. Common causes of mealybugs are ants. Ants sometimes like to bring mealybugs to a house plant so they can feed off the honeydew residue that's produced by the bugs. Bringing home a new contaminated plant or using contaminated soil can also bring mealybugs into your home. Putting your house plants outside can also lead to an infestation or even through your groceries and fresh flowers. The best control for mealybugs is preventive. Healthy plants are less susceptible to infestation than weak, underpotted, stressed out plants. If you get them anyway, here's what to do. Bring your plant to the shower and wash the leaves and stems with a fair amount of water pressure. You want to forcefully get the bugs off your plant, but be careful of not damaging the leaves or breaking any of the stems. If there are any mealybugs left, use some cotton soaked in rubbing alcohol to kill the bug and to clean the infected areas. Be sure to check under the leaves, the soil and around the corners of your pot. When it looks like you're clear, we like to use a neem oil spray. Neem oil is a natural pest control product that messes with an insect's hormonal balance, so it dies before being able to mature. Neem oil is safe for your plants and does a good job of preventing future infestations. Give the plant a good spray all around once a week till the bugs completely disappear. In the worst case scenario, if after treatment in a couple of weeks it's still uh, not getting any better and the bugs keep coming back, you can consider getting rid of the plant before it infects all the others that you have. We hope you will never have to refer to this video again, but if you do get some mealybugs, you are now well equipped to handle any situation. We will see you in another two weeks for another episode of Into the Weeds.